act. Who cares, right? Okay. He's left. It is impossible to stare. Now what am I doing? All oh, right, I have to go over there. Ha. Petter, petter, petter. Maybe Ruben didn't really commit suicide? Maybe that was another fake out. Um hope I don't fight you guys. Your name, we shall identify you. I am Bachelor Dunkowski, the authorized representative of the Inquisitor. I heard the sanitary staff. Your company commander should have let you know. Oh, so what are you here for? Under half to Burlock, report the situation. It's you who will answer my question now. By what right are you here? Certainly you do not want to go under the tribunal. We are here on duty, fair fellow. Does this mean you're a friend of the criminal or an accomplice? Then it'll be interesting for you to know that your friend is a subject to the responsibility for cold-hearted murder of four military men. Our informer has specified that the architect murderer lives here. The verdict will be put in action immediately, and you now will show us... Oh no, I feel Peter was taken for someone else. What will you want to do? Um... Peter murder for guys? What are you talking, fair? Our direct commander is Captain Longin, the commander of the 15th Company. The investigation of the attack at the sanitary patrol fire throws is conducted by him. More questions? We shall find him anyway, sooner or later. Alrighty, we have the operative data that one of the criminals is hiding in the ruins of the building in a central district of town and renders fire resistance. Advise you to assist with his arrest, otherwise... Peter couldn't kill anybody. He's kind of a pussy, honestly. Um... I bring Peter to a grave for to Andre's luck. Listen now as he begs that he cares of his vulnerable brother, and the brother certainly will start with burning his works. Means he is now somewhere in town, but where? Let's go talk to Andre. Because he's on the way down anyway. <sighs> oh, fuck me. Fuck, 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 fuck. That's unfair. What? What ifs? There are a lot of extra shavers out today. More than the usual. Ruben's still alive, I'm gonna punch him in the face. I think that's a clear decision. Oh, you came in the right time. We had a kind of adventure. My Navajo knife has drunk blood, eaten in trails. Give me an advice, which is better. To move my brother here, to keep him at hand, or I better move to him. Oh, God. They're talking exactly like Griff. I was quoting Griff. <laughs> so much. He loves such things. As he says, they attract luck to the weapon and help to avoid a malicious return. Actually, it's scary, you know, to kill someone. It'll be repaid. I know it. I've checked on myself. 
him have you killed? You see, my dear brother sees now angels and fairies and is conducting his drunken talks with the bottles, and he's discussing so well he more listens to them rather than speaks to them himself. Well, then it came to his head, as I have understood, he decided that he had not achieved his limit and decided to test the destiny. Did he have a crisis? Did it begin yesterday? Strange imaginations occurred to him. He had a wish to walk around his early works, if one may say so, these ugly ruins. Stairways to heaven that stick out here and there. He said that he. What? Oh! Those! He said that he wanted to find a place for something, to choose the best one, for what I have not understood. Well, what kind of venture could I do? Well, what kind of venture could I do? He broke loose and ran to the street, crazy and a disordered feeling. He suddenly met the soldiers. I was told that he was going out. He made noise in the room. So good that I made it in time. He made the royal gunman angry by something that started to beat the life out of him by the butts, and, and you know. What's wrong with you? Now I shall settle here all my affairs, and that's it. I shall never leave him alone again. Here he shall eternally tortured because of his exclusiveness. A genius may just poke his nose from the house, and he'll be immediately stoked by lightning. But you know, you are the same, in fact. Why don't you take him with you? Why should I? They even did not know who Peter e Petter is and where he lives. He never reported them, I hope. Even if it has something, none of them are left alive. No, Andre, I never was as crazy as you. What about my brother? Do you have any news from him? I'll go find him, I guess. If he's drunk. What's this? I have money. I'll take it all. Let's drink anyway. Where am I going? Okay, if he's in those stairways to heaven. Where are they at? No, it kind of looks like that. That's one I remember. Where's that one? I think that's one. I don't know what that is. Chocolate theater. I don't know. There's one there. There's one like over there. No, that's the only one I can think of. Honestly. Is there one over here? Oh, I see. So yeah, it'd be that, or maybe that, because I can't remember what that is. Or maybe that. I need to swing down south, so I'll hit that one, and then that one, that one, and then that one. Let's go three if our buddy Ruben is still alive. Well, let's see Anna, too. Anna's right over here. You go away. Go away. Go away. You're not moving. You're going this way. Maybe I shouldn't. Whatever, take them both.
Hey, dude. Why am I still wearing gloves? I don't have gloves anymore. I sold them. God, this place is always diseased. I feel bad for him. Who's supposed to be right around here somewhere? Really? There. Just on his house? That's more Fords. He's still in his laboratory, maybe? Oh, he's dead. I guess I can't finish this one. You motherfucker! The roundup they let me go, but this cannot be. George was supposed to put me to death. Why must he have put you to death? Why, for sacrilege? Or you have not understood what destiny has ever taken Simon. Tell me the truth, you have been a Simon alive. What well, does it mean? Simon is dead. Now he is definitely dead, though he was alive. All the time while he was considered dead. Uh, he was alive. No. Thanks, you were just enough for me. Katarina Sabrov. Well, Katarina, Clara has already made something through her. Has taken away the force and the crown of the mistress from her. Did she exactly tell so? It's impossible. So, Clara is now the mistress? I, with my own hands, took Simon into smallest particles and transformed him into white vaccine. Why well, are you sure that the person whose body you've taken into pieces was Simon? You think... You think? I do not know how Simon looked. You think he could be compared to by figure, force, majesty to his brother or whoever else? After all, whose blood, except for his superhuman blood, could battle so long with the disease and almost defeat it, though at the cost of lethargy? Whose? I never understand me. Never, for all that time I am here at you, have seen Simon Kane, the only person whom I hope to see here. Neither alive nor dead. What should I believe? Fine. Ask in horns. If they let you go, that means they really do not consider me either a murderer nor the church robber. Let them explain where Simon is. I explained all. By the name of teacher, tell me, Reuben, did you tell the truth? All is true. I have divided Simon into particles. I put the fire everything of which it was impossible to make vaccine. I could not confuse him with anybody else, you see. Only from this hundred um, from this unique organism the white vaccine could have been obtained. The vaccine which till now supports the lives of hundreds of people. I give you the word of honor. Alright. So my way again lies to the horns, as then nine days ago when I was directed here by your teacher. Okay. I guess Ruben is alive. I thought he was dead all this time. Yeah, we'll go to Maria's first, because we're banging her. Hmm. Eat my Metapod. Eat my Metapod. Eat my Metapod. Drink my Metapod. Fuck my metapod. What just happened? What's high? My infection. As usual. That's nothing new. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Eat my metapod. This house oppresses me. Nice one to be convinced that you're still alive. Let me off.
Let's hope that he's there, because that's the one that I remember the most. If not, we're going to have to find the other one. <laughs> 